Hey guys, this is N236, um, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a Lego Deadpool figure. Um, so, first off, um, this is what my version of the Deadpool figure looks like without, uh, without all his stuff. Get this in focus. Um, so yeah, uh, pretty detailed. I think this is one of my best ones. You can see the uh, the abs, the in detail there. Whoa. <laughs> Whoops. Um, but uh, probably one of my better ones. Um, and now I'm going to show you how to make them. So the pieces you will need are um, a red body head legs, arms, hands, well, pretty much an all-around red figure, completely red figure. Um, don't put all the parts on it yet, um, because they'll need to be sharpened individually, which brings me to the materials you'll need, which are, um, a whiteout pen or quick dry whiteout, but there's going to be some really finite um, stuff you have to do with the whiteout, so I suggest the whiteout pen. Um, a black sharpie. Um, again, probably with the double sided. Um, and a pencil, very well sharpened pencil. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. Okay, first with the body, which I think is the easiest part to do. Um, so you start with the body, and you make a. Um, you're using the black sharpie and you make um you make a shape that looks like um a circle at the bottom here but don't round it off at the top so you just kind of make a circle that's going to be um this part at the bottom right here the circle part and then you're going to bring it up like this, like a vase, and then whoosh out the edges, like that. Um, so once you've done that with a black sharpie, um, you're going to do, do sharpie the sides also, so you get uh, this effect. Um, and you don't really have to do anything to the back if you don't want to, um, so you can just leave that blank. And, uh, so you put that aside once you're finished with that. And when you're done with it, uh, when you're done with doing the Sharpie part, it should look something like this. Oh, yeah, and probably Sharpie the, uh, the top also. So you leave that to the side. Alright, next thing, probably the easiest, is... I'd say the legs. And, uh, so what you do with the legs basically is you put kind of sharpie blocks on the sides of the tops of the legs, um, with the sharpie. And then with the finite point, you, um, get where the uh, leg meets the foot. So you get those little straps that he has on his feet by his ankles so that for the legs you should get something like this looks about like that Oops, there we go. yep and then for the middle leg piece you do a little black circle with the sharpie in the middle I'll get here I'll get it by itself um, so wait so you let the legs dry 
and then for the middle leg piece, um, make a black circle in the middle with two um, sharpie penned uh, white dots, so, so it looks like a, a face with two eyes. And then you're going to go with the fine part. You're going to do these little um, boxes on the sides of it, probably three. That's what I had room for. Um, and then you make little V shapes on the top of the boxes to make uh, little parts in his belt. And so you let that dry. Um, next are the arms which are pretty easy. All you have to do is um, make a... by the shoulders you just um, sharpie it black on both and if you want you can do a little bit of sharpening at the end of the arm where it meets the hand on both of them but um, it doesn't really matter personally I just like the, uh, the black sharpie only. So once you do that you leave those to the side and you do nothing with the hands um, and if you don't have any of these red parts or anything you can just red sharpie them um, uh, from being yellow hands and you can sharpie them red like I did with this one just to show you you can do that too um, alright the head the head is probably the hardest part um, so that's why we're doing that one last. So here we got the head, and what we're gonna do is, if you want, if you're kind of uh, nervous about uh, doing it with the sharpie first, you should go over it in the pencil if you can see it. If not, go ahead with the sharpie wherever you want. Um, and what you would do is you'd make triangles with the pencil. Um, you just kind of outline them like that, and then you would go over those of uh, the triangles are um, both facing inward, so they uh, the points of the triangles the points of the triangles look like that, and they're facing inward, both of the eyes. And so you go over it with the sharpie, and you kind of round the edges of the triangle uh, of the triangles like I did here um, and so you after you let that dry um, then you go in with the sharpie pen and you make the, the eyes in the middle if you make too big of an eye it's okay you can go over it again in sharpie um, which is what I love about doing this um, and once you let all your pieces dry and you think you're all set, um, you put them together. So let's see how this comes out. Last leg here, and boom! You have got a Lego Deadpool figure.